From Interior Alaska's most trusted news source, this is your morning news update with J.R. Lewis. Good morning and thanks for joining us. It's Friday, July 5th, 2013, and unfortunately leading our news, sources close to News Center 11 say that a North Pole woman critically injured June 29th in an ATV accident near Delta Junction has died. They say Carla Converse passed away Wednesday evening around 6.10 p.m. Converse, according to the source, had been kept on life support as family traveled to Alaska from the lower 48. Troopers say Converse was driving a Honda ATV down a bank onto the road when the ATV rolled over and landed on top of her. Troopers say she was not wearing a helmet at the time of the accident. Infrared flights have shown that a fire south of Two Rivers is nearly half the size previously believed because the fire is burning in fingers instead of one solid block. Fire Information Spokeswoman Mary Hewell says the Stewart Creek 2 fire burning near non-populated areas is burning on about 30,000 acres or about 46 square miles. Fire officials are still cautioning residents that an evacuation could be ordered while cooler temperatures and lighter winds are expected to help firefighters control the blaze. And the city of Fairbanks would see penalties for littering drop to $250 in a citation under a proposed change to the law from former mayor or from mayor, current mayor, Jerry Cleworth. AP reports the change would make the penalty more like a traffic ticket and less like a criminal offense. Cleworth says he proposed the change to save time for both the city and people cited for littering. The current penalty is up to $450 in fines and up to 40 hours of community service picking up trash. Quick look at the Fairbanks weather. Today, mostly cloudy with isolated showers and some areas of smoke. Highs in the mid to upper 60s. Tonight, mostly cloudy. Areas of smoke and lows in the mid to upper 40s. And then tomorrow, mostly cloudy with areas of smoke again. Highs in the lower to mid 70s. Extended outlook, mostly cloudy weekend. Highs in the upper 70s. And a chance of rain for the start of next week with a high 70 to 75. And that's all we have for right now. Glad you could join us. Remember, for more news, sports, or weather, download our free mobile app for Android and Apple devices. From all of us here, I'm J.R. Lewis. Thanks for watching.